The French AMX-50 Foch was an experimental tank destroyer with extremely thick frontal armor developed during the 1950s. Towards the end of the decade, the most powerful Soviet vehicle was the T-10M heavy tank, armed with a high-velocity 122mm cannon. Surprisingly, it wasn't until the 1960s that Soviet tanks began to receive high-explosive anti-tank and sub-caliber projectiles with them having to rely on full-caliber AP until this point. Even then, the frontal armor of the Foch would have been able to resist early armor-piercing fin-stabilized discarding Sabo projectiles, with only heat warheads posing a threat. Ultimately, the Foch project was cancelled, with the French transitioning towards developing lighter and more conventional main battle tanks, like the AMX-30.